everybody, Micah from APG here coming at you again, hopefully this time on the correct day, <coughs> future me. Life is Strange, Episode 3, Chaos Theory. I don't even remember where I left off, let's just be real. Holy crap. So we about to find out where I left off, because I don't remember. I really don't. It's been quite a long minute since I played this game. Oh yeah, okay, we were in the truck. Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. It's just life. Shit happens. It's nobody's Truth. fault. Blah, 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 as Mr. Jefferson would say. And, and Kate Marsh, yes, Kate Marsh almost killed herself. Such sad, okay? That doesn't make me feel any better about my fucked up life. Get it? God. So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. <laughs> Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you Dang. don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. You don't want to hear this, but you're still here. Alive. With me. God, it's and that emotional. Is no accident. God. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. And Rachel needs you. I don't know why we're upset. Was this. Was this after the argument with her. With. Uh, I don't know what's going on, man. Okie dokie. Dang, that happened. Well, that happened. Alrighty. Uh, 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 okay. Cool. Oh my god. What is happening now? Okay, what was that? Can she, like, read memories through pictures now? Pardon that professional voice crack. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna shut up real quick. Okay, I'm unshutting up. I'm sorry, what? Use A and D keys and left and right mouse button until I find the sweet spot. Is that it? Did I do it? Oh, that's bright! Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... Uh... Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Okay, did she yeah, just time travel this picture? Just allow this one into the family album. No. The what is this? But not the cook. William Hand is here. Hands, Daddy. Yes, and we can't Chloe is just a kid. And Am I that far back in time? You, you can straight France, time travel that I'm far back now. I'm years old inside my 13-year-old self. How? Oh, this is crazy. I volunteer to break the eggs. 
dude, what am I supposed remember to remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. That's true. Now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. Just make me look young. So how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right. You can like see the bond between Chloe and her father. And the love. Now this is a photo. I'll let her know that. What in the world? Joyce is... loves William so much. Dude, this is trippy. I love William like he was in my own family. I won't let him die today. I won't. Hello? Oh no. How many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am when your mom is away. I'll let her know that. Am I not allowed to answer the thing? Ah, oh, farts. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast you upon. You are ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit. What a mess we made. That's a dollar for I remember those cool drawings I did with Chloe. Keys, please. Okay, so I have to find the keys first. Okay. Like you're the real cook. Hold on, I have to let him leave first? Is that what it is? Christ I on a bloody cracker. Leaves. I'll let her know that. <gasps> Boom. Oh, no. Disconnected. Really? Really? That's the Oh hey, staying. It's still there. Hey honey. I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work for oh two ways. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Oh my god. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She don't have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. <laughs> You are ridiculous. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? Oh my god. That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. I don't know what to do, and I'm sorry I'm not talking a lot. I'm just confused and pancakes. Aha. Uh -huh. You can't hide from me forever. Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. I don't know how to and stop no him. no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Oh my Max, god. you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. Okay, so I have to go back. Okay, so did I have to let him leave first? I'm so sorry, I'm rusty. It's been a very long time since I played this game. 
remember That's true. Score. Don't you dare question the chef. Right. Like you don't think that's how this works. Is this okay, this is good this is what messes things up. I guarantee this is where the game goes bad. I'll let her know that. Boom. Disconnected. I'm just gonna let the cell phone call go through. Bruh. So this is gonna happen. I know I've seen those pictures before. Dude. Dow. Hey, honey. I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Matt. That's a cool oh, snow dough. What? Oh, Can I shake? I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. The you Save don't have Mart. Many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. <laughs> Chloe was so into manga. Nice hair. Hey, that's what her hair winds up looking like. You are ridiculous. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the square, square jar. Jar. Man, I remember Chloe reading this. <laughs> but not after today. Oof. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. I really hope doing what I just did works. Although, again, again, I guarantee this is where things go very, very bad. Shit, where are those keys? That's... Another dollar for the swear jar! You're bankrupting me! I knew this thing would come in handy. How did my keys get in here? And no Chloe and Max Is there no way to happen. stop it? Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us I a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate problem. cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. God. Okay, so I gotta hide the keys. And of course I didn't see where he found that thing from home. Said it depends. That's true. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here. I am when your mom is away. I'll let her know that. Uh, Mr. Price, in case you're thinking about using your car, I heard there's awful traffic and road construction. So you shouldn't drive at all. Max, you are the road warrior. I promise, if I have to go anywhere, I'll drive like I'm taking a test. Fair enough? Not really. I just know the roads are bad and stuff, so... So you... Since you're obviously my personal GPS, I feel safer already. So don't look so worried, Max. God dang it. Oh, dude. Okay, so they're electric. Is that how this works? That did it? <gasps> I have a brain! I know I had those keys right here. I know it. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys! Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. <laughs> you can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh, oh yeah, the bus God. is great. Uh, it comes every 15 minutes, and, and there'll be plenty of room for you and, and Joyce and groceries, and and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome! So what did I just do? How much of the feet? So, like, what just changed? 
Okay, they, they're, they're all burning away. Um... What's going on? This is so trippy. This is beyond freaking trippy. Okay, I am... Oh, that's actually kind of a creepy picture. I don't like that. That's just a little scary. Okay, so... If what just happened... If what I just... If what I think just happened, happened... Then... Hello? Are you even listening, Maxine? All my friends in LA told me that Oregon was Max. Cold every day. Never like Maxine. So I know. Sorry, Mad Max. <laughs> You're not pissed at me, right? No, right? Do you want to go hit the girls' potty and smoke them peace pipe? I think Max is high. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? What? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like, whatever, bitch. I am so... Right. He confused. hooked up with Stella? Okay. Oh no. This is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Oh my god. Chloe. Dude. Dude. <laughs> Oh my god, he's the bus driver. What the fudge, dude? Dude. Dude. Bet you this is copyrighted. There's gonna be a huge portion of this that I skip. And then she says things, and then I'm gonna skip to all the parts where she talks. And then I will be not there. Yeah. Oh my god. All the birds. I'm so confused. 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 Stop with copyrighted music. I guarantee you it's copyrighted. Skips. Skips are gonna happen. Why is Matt's in the bus driver? I mean, I know why, because Max changed everything. Who are you? That is a beach whale. That is a... Two beach whales. Three beach whales. No, that's two whales and a shark? Oh my god, this game is ripping me apart. I'm confused in every way about everything. This is probably going to be a shorter episode than usual. Because I'm going to assume this is probably the end. Alright, so she done... Traveled back in time. She done traveled back in time and changed everything. Max Caulfield. Taking a break after taking Seattle by storm, huh? We thought we'd never see you again after you left for the big city. No. I'd never do that to Chloe. Speaking of, I know she's been dying to see you. Hold on. Oh my god. Chloe, you have a visitor. Holy crap. That probably got really bassy and really breaky. What the fudge? What happened to Clo Oh my f yes. 
I'm sorry. What? No, oh, man. If y'all could see me right now, I am... You can't just do that to me. No, no. No. You you can't just do that to me, man. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude. I screwed up. I screwed up. <laughs> you can't do that to me. I'm sorry. What? She's paralyzed? <laughs> Was this like the... Okay, no, no. I'm sorry. What now? <laughs> no, okay. I, I, I can't play any more of that tonight. My, my brain is broken in every possible way. Um. Um. Yeah, that's, that's, I'm ending this one here. Um, I need time to process this. I'll see y'all again next Friday for the start of episode 4 of the Dark Room. Oh my, I have a headache now. Oh god. Yeah. Okay, I lied to y'all. I didn't pick the next episode. Yes, I did. Whoa. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Don't ever touch me again, freak! I'm still rolling from like the last half hour of my life here. Although I think well, it's a half hour, but I uh, I'm about a hundred percent sure. What are you doing here, Matt? It was actually going to be like less than that. I'm probably at around 20 or 25 minutes. It won't work. I know this isn't pleasant for any of us. My head Tell us hurts everything. so much, but I can't. I gotta see more. Stelm and Louise. That's Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Welcome to my domain. Let's find what we want and beat it. Max, you better come check out these files. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. Listen, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank. Being more than a friend. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? Mm. No, you don't. That's what happened. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> Hello? Are you even listening, Maxine? I don't like you. This is totally fucked up. That's, what else have yeah, I changed? that's a shark and two whales. Max Caulfield. Hold on. Chloe, you have a visitor. Oh my god. I, I, I can't. I had to do this. This is only going to be like a 20 minute video. If I had left... <clears throat> <sighs> oh 
hold it together, man. Dude, like, my head is actually spinning right now. But I can't. I, I, I can't not. I can't just leave it. I can't just leave it where it was. I've got to play about another 20 or 30 minutes. Because this was absolutely effing sh crazy. My brain is on fire. It's a crib. Is crib about to die? Hello again, Mr. Square Enix. How much of this is going to be copyrighted? So, how, like, how much of this am I going to have to skip because of copyright? Look, a bike. Pretty well rendered. Well rendered bikes. Oh, that's one of the beached animals. That's a whale. That's one of the beached whales. How? That's so many beached animals. Jesus. Whales for years. Okay, yeah, those are all whales. What's going on? Max, what did you do? You screwed up so many things. And I guarantee you can't fix it. Without making it worse again. Because that's like... Freaking 30 of those things on the beach. What has to hold her head up? What happened to her? Oh my god, please get to the talking! Please! I need to hear the things in the stuff. It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. What is the tube it in your nice throat? It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. But I love writing on it like an English poet. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. I just want to know what happened. Uh, pretty much, yeah. Look, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. See? Without you here, I'd have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. You can even the option game? Those are so sad. I kind of know how they feel. At least, I'm alive here with you. What the hell happened? Pardon my language. You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Oh my god. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Do you remember everything? I saw everything in bullet time. I felt my back snap and... And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Dang! I, I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. What, what missing girl? I don't know her name. I just read about it in the news. I feel bad for her family. This is such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. It might be, but... I'd like to think we can still change things for the better. Oh. I'd like to think that too. But I don't have much hope these days. I know things seem out of control, oh. but... As long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, 
Chloe, I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. I was wrong. You're my best friend. Max, thanks for coming out to see me. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? It is hella cold out here. Hella? I hate that word, no offense. None taken. Holy crap! She is full on paralyzed. Dude, this is so screwed up. Oh my god, dude. Snow eclipsed beach whales. Snow eclipse beached whales. Wow, I. English. Guess I need to go back to school. Learn how to talk again. Oh my sweet Jesus, this game is doing awful things to my brain. Oh my jeebers. I mean, she can move her head. Pretty high tech layer. Feels like a high tech cell. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. I know it's hard for them. You're grateful you are here with them. Oh my gosh. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, I know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive. When you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. Or when doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. I'm actually trying not to cry right now. Thanks again for coming, Max. I, uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Uh, can you, can you bring me some water? This is absolutely screwed up. Okay, so she gets a room on the bottom floor of the house. Snow globes, snow does. Where's the freaking water? That's makeup. Uh, water? Lamp. Window. Lifter. Medical ventilator. Oh, do I have to, like, leave the room to get some water? Uh, where, where's your water, lady? Oh! Drink up, buttercup. This is the person. Oh, man. No wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? I wish I could punch your face right now. A podcast? Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You sound like an adult now. It seems like we were kids in another life. <laughs> if only you knew. What do you remember about us as kids? We all have different memories. I think about us as little pirates running and jumping through Arcadia Bay. This is me too. Very depressing. But we're still pirates in our own way. <laughs> yeah, right. Check me out, Chloe of the Caribbean. No way will I get on a fucking boat now. Unless you're with me. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. You have me. I'm not leaving you, Chloe. Well, you didn't visit me a lot either. I mean, I loved your cards and photos, but... I know I wasn't around much. No excuses. I'm a loser. But I am trying to make things right. How? Dude, you're not super max. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. They love you so oh, much. Oh, boy. I know. 
My mom and dad are so cute. They always pop in here and make sure everything's okay with me. I think Joyce and William are incredible. Max, the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks and the medical bills are fucking insane. Can they pay all the bills? No way. They keep the numbers away from me, but it doesn't take much research to find out I'm costing my parents almost a million dollars a year. Jesus! Um, you're priceless. Uh, no pun intended. <laughs> you are such a geek. That's why I love you. Of course, I know a geek when I be one. I'm sitting here. This is gonna be very quiet. Half an audacity file. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. What do you want to oh watch? Oh my god. Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know, I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. <laughs> Freaking uh, right. Blade you Runner's good stuff. You incredible with blue hair. Now let's get this show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when you watch movies. I remember, Max. I swear I won't fall asleep. This not when you're here. game has... This game has a way of Tearing you apart, dude. That must be her mighty morphine machine. Oh, God. No more bombs for her. Oh, my God. I made that mix for her when we were 12. Jesus. Max, it is so cool that you're here again. I'm glad you think so. Game. <laughs> Respond to my controls. Uh, here's the DVD. Hey, Blade Runner. Oh, pardon me. Get you a chair, Maxi Face. Are there actually going to be, like, clips from Blade Runner in here? Like, or is it just going to be sound effects and stuff? Bruh. I actually kind of want to watch Blade Runner again. That was good stuff. Blade Runner's amazing. She's looking. This is extremely depressing. Yet kind of endearing question mark oh lord max you fell asleep in that horrible chair there's a sleepy chloe sleepy crippled chloe oh she's awake actually Who fell asleep first? That's the real question. I can't believe you fell asleep so fast. Oh. How dare you. I know you were beat down after the day with me. And Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Uh, do, you, do you think Deckard is a replicant? Sorry, I can see you're not wide awake like me. No. I'm sorry I crashed so hard. Were you okay? I do have a mother and father when you're not falling asleep on me. Fair enough. You are a bitch in the morning. It's the company I keep. Fair enough. <laughs> but yeah, it's, 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 it's creepy and endearing. Blast. It was great. I need help. Me. This 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 game is making my head hurt. When we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like when we were little pirates jumping and running through the, the forest, forest again. And you said pirates last night. Just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. Uh, fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you pretty please go upstairs and get my my morphine injector in the bathroom? Morphine injector? It's uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep this wag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? I'm on it, Chloe. Oh my sweet god. I mean, you can't open doors. 
Hey, William. Um, am I bothering you? Why, yes, Max. I love going through bills. <laughs> Kidding. How can you bother me? I haven't seen you in forever. I know. You look exactly the same. <laughs> it's so cool. Dude. Good. Or I'd be scared if I didn't look like me. <laughs> of course, you seem more adult now. <laughs> so what's on your mind? I don't know how to say this, but I'm truly sorry about what happened to Chloe. Me too. All it takes is a few minutes to change a girl's whole life. But she's alive. And she's been a trooper. Is she mad at me for not staying in touch? She should be. I have no excuse. She was disappointed. But she knows you care. This is and I know so sad. to process all this. It's taken us years. William, Jeez. I just want you to know that whatever happens, I'll always be here for Chloe. Always. I know you will, Max. This dude has an epic voice, too. Like, holy crap. I was impressed. He sounds like a radio talk really show host. All the high tech equipment. You should be. We could buy a few mansions for what it all costs. <laughs> Insurance helps, but uh, I don't know, Max. I know it must be hard on you guys, financially. These bills are more like crushing. We have to mortgage our home, and that's pretty scary. But, but we'll get through it. Price is always right. Get it? No? Being in the voice again is oh. so nostalgic. Very old school, as they say. Oh. <laughs> I think it's great what for Chloe to see you. Makes Joyce happy, too. So, it's not all bad news in Arcadia Bay. Or is it? The Prescott family might be bad news. What do you think about them? Evil. Next question? Sounds like you know them well. More than I want to. But oh boy. Joyce has to work for those greedy bastards at Pan Estates. I don't even like to think about it. What do you think is going Ugh. on with all of this crazy weather and animals dying? Nobody knows, right? Bad things. It is Nostradamus type shit, pardon my French. But all I actually care about now is Chloe and Joyce. My family. It's fair enough. I was reading about that missing girl. Rachel Amber. Oh, yes, yeah, she went to Blackwell, right? Oh, poor thing. That's a real this nightmare for so family. Crazy. I get scared thinking about Chloe and that we might lose her someday. I have to go see if Chloe needs anything. It was so great talking with you again. <laughs> you act like it's the last time. And please, keep me from these bills whenever you want. Ha <laughs> Uh... That's not normal. How can you still text? I kinda, I mean, I, I kinda read the, the things. Oh, it, yep, yep, upstairs. Thank you. That's nice. I like upstairs. The Pikachu is still the same. Oh, Max, it is so nice to have you around. Uh, oh. Good morning, Max. Oh, okay. Uh, you and Chloe are so much quieter now than when you were kids. I remember. Uh, it's nice waking up in your house again. Oh, William and I love it. Finally seeing you and Chloe together after all these years. This That's game it. hurts me. Accident. I wish I was a better friend. I know Chloe doesn't get many visitors. Oh, Max. You're Chloe's best friend for a reason. You're here <laughs> exactly when she needs you. I mean... 
Who helps Chloe out when you guys are at work? Oh boy. A series of revolving nurses and caretakers. <laughs> Chloe still causes trouble even if she can't move. Max, Chloe's condition is not improving. Her respiratory system is very weak and she... she... Do you know what I'm saying? I'm so sorry you have to go through all this. This is painful. Bad or good, I embrace every moment with my daughter and my husband. This is what it means to be a family. See, Max, this... And we'll always be one. No matter what. Max, this is what you do when you play God. This is what happens when when, when, when a human tries How to be a God. How are you doing, Joyce? I'm doing the best I can, Max. I won't lie, it's difficult, but... Nobody said life was easy here in Arcadia Bay. <laughs> so, what do you think is going on here with all oh, of this? This game is dirty. Maybe Arcadia Bay just wants to be left alone. <laughs> I know the feeling. Honestly, I don't give a shit about too much outside our house. I don't blame you, Joyce. Except now we have dead birds, birds and, and beach, beach whales, whales outside our front door. So maybe I should care. For Chloe's sake. Yeah, something bad's about to happen. Plus, you guys have to work, too. Ah, uh, Bill and I have no time for ourselves. We're working more than we're living. Yeah. I even had to take a part-time gig at Pan Estates. Ugh. Do you know the Prescotts? I know that Sean Prescott won't be happy until he owns everything in Arcadia Bay. Fair enough. Stay away from his son, Nathan. Do you know somebody named David Madsen? He, um, might hang out at the two wheels. Well, that was random. Yeah, he's a, a bus driver. He comes in sometimes. Cute, quiet. Why? Oh, um, I, w I was just curious. You always were. <laughs> nice to see that everything doesn't change. Interesting. I have to tell you... How much I love seeing you and William together again. He's been such a hero through all this. Dude. Chloe and I, are lucky to have him. Is William still the same? After everything that's happened? For better and for worse. But always for the better. I, I never thought I'd love a man so much I can't imagine life without him. It sounds corny, I know. Oh, jeez. Things would be different if I did. I like how you think, kid. I better get back to Chloe now. It's good talking with you, Joyce. You too, honey. My god. That's right, bathroom. It's in the bathroom. I at least had to do the correct thing and go talk to the parents. Is this the bathroom? Wait, there's something I want to do. Because this was Chloe's room. In the future. Now it's just a storage room. Oh, shoes, toys. Was this on a letter? Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. Yeah. They bought crutches for Chloe, hoping she might walk again. Oh, dude. Toys? I kind of want to open this and see what's in here. Do you gonna give me the option? Nope. Okay. Shoes. Chloe always did love stomping around in her book. I never heard much about William's brother. I don't want to read it. Sit down. I'm still overwhelmed by this new reality. Yeah. I feel so guilty for putting Chloe and her family. <laughs> you should. I guess we stopped growing up together. Well, yeah. But at least we never had to hide from step douche. Oh. A blue butterfly. I'm sure this is a total coincidence. This is absolutely jacked up. Okay, are you the bathroom? 
Holy moly. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Nice. It's cool that Chloe uses natural medicine too. Dude. Well, she don't have a choice. Nothing here. Uh, cabinet. The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. For obvious reasons. Here it is. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. It is some Star Trek business looking. Oh, turn off the light. Whoop, downstairs, please. Okay. No, I don't think Joyce's tips will cover all this. Oh, they changed it. Okay, they changed the garage into the bedroom. Oh, okay, see, I thought I was going to come in the door and she was like dead. I'm not even kidding. Finally. Uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. I'm nosy, but not precise. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. And painless. Um, okay, but get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Of course, my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Um, stop me if I'm being too emo. But can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Please, my diary is like emo ground zero. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Ever. Bruh. Does Chloe look at the garden and think about her childhood? Probably. She can't even feel the grass now. God, that's depressing. Photo album. Okay, so I think whenever we get to the next like thing where the game has to, the game has, uh, saves. Whoa, Chloe can totally control her computer. It's so great people get this high tech help. That is kind of cool. There's the old Chloe. <laughs> Bruh. Grab that photo album over there and let's have a flashback. Got it. Oh, why did I do that? The chair was right there. Yo, boy's not smart some days. Correct, most days. Is that okay? Her. Ever. <laughs> oh my god. Look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. And you laughed at him. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Turn the page. Whoa, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. Yeah. There's still time for you. I have a very sad feeling that the game is going to kill her, and then Max is going to like lose oh, her man. crap and then travel back. There we back. are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Me too. Oh no. Maybe I could... Oh, it's not gonna do what I thought it would. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and... And it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along. And I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying 
that being with you again has been so special. Oh, it's going to be a I different just turn. I to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible. And you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Do you understand? Yes, I do. All you have to do is clean up the ivy for me. I knew that was coming. I should have. <laughs> oh my god. What's the correct? There is there a correct option? Chloe, I really don't know if I can do this. I had another friend who wa wanted to end it all, and I did everything I could to try and save her life. How can I be responsible for ending yours? I mean, th there's got to be another way. Oh, not again. Once you were there for your friend, no matter what. Now I'm asking you to help me the same way. I want to help you, Chloe, but I, th I think my help is hurting. At least you have a choice. When you want to make a decision, you can just do it. Look at me. I'm at the mercy of everybody. For once. Oh my god. I want to make my own choice. The most important one of my life. Please. Help me, Max. Um, <laughs> oh, Marius, you lied to me. You said there wasn't another bad thing in the game that was going to make me want to do things to myself, like cry myself to sleep. Oh, my God. Okay, look, see, okay, if I accept it, that's going to cripple Max mentally, but it will give Chloe what she wants, and if I refuse it, It'll still hurt Max, and it will make Chloe hate her. That's gotta be what's gonna happen. So, <sighs> oh God. Oh. Chloe. I'm gonna. Dream to sleep. <sighs> Dreaming of us here together. God dang it. Forever. Why do you make me make these decisions, game? I hate these things. Oh, my gut. This is absolutely awful. I don't. Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you for following your dreams. Don't forget about me. Never. I love you, Max. See you around. Sooner than you think. Oh, this is so messed up. I had to make this choice. Okay, Max. What are you going to do to fix it? Well, first, you should probably switch the IV. I'm sorry, William. You're gonna switch it. Yeah, you dang well better switch it back. There we go. Wasn't too difficult. Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. 
This is a keeper. Hello? Hey, honey. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the square jar. You mean your college fund? Aha! You can't hide from me forever. Oh my god. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting section. Dad. Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be good too, right? He's never Salute. That makes all of them. Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like, you're never gonna see us again. Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. I, I did try. I'm sorry. I don't know exactly what you're talking about, but come on. You have made things different, like, my whole life. You're my best friend. God, you're tall. I've got you and a great family. What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. <sighs> Listen, whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. I'll always have your back. Always. is being uh, deleted and replaced back to the way it was. Oh my sweet Jesus. Oh yeah, because there's the truck that got her killed. Well, not, well, indirectly got her killed. Holy crap. This is so messed up. I don't know how to deal with any of this right now. I really don't. Okay, so you changed everything again. Except I assume you changed it. Oh my gosh, back. Safe for work. Chloe, you're alive. Yes. Whoa, whoa, down, Max. You get one kiss, now you're all over me. I'm just, I'm just, I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. <laughs> Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome back to the real world, Max. Okay, Let's can I look turn at that the off? Board and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. I'm not allowed to turn that off. Oh my god. It's gonna be copyrighted, so it's gonna copyright me so much. So close, yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Yeah, we do. Uh, um, what things? Yeah, what things are they? One, actually? decipher Frank's logbook. Definitely. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. For sure. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Free beat step douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the dark room. Too bad I don't have a gun anymore. 
Yes, that's the solution. We'll have to do this on our uh. own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. Fine, whatevs. Do it power. <laughs> Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. You didn't even let me take that money to pay Frank off. And I'm glad. We have to be better than that. Uh, you should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Okay, who? And be careful of step crack. He's not gonna be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. I can't abuse this level of my rewind power. Can we just get out of the room so I don't get copyrighted anymore? I need a thing I need the, the, the where's the little thing that shows up and there it is okay okay this is actually the end the other one's not gonna be an end I'm pretty sure I'll make a joke of it too in fact I know I will this is the real end of the video I'm still gonna go sit down and like try to piece together what I just played. I still have a headache. But yeah, that was, um, that was nuts. Nope, nope, nope. <sighs> yeah, okay, yeah. I will see y'all next Friday.